वेलकम टू द प्रोजेक्ट डेमोस्ट्रेशन ऑफ स्मार्ट हेलमेट टू ऑटोमेटिक इग्निशन कंट्रोलिंग सिस्टम बेस्ड ऑन हेलमेट माउंट डिटेक्शन एंड अल्कोहल सेंसर सो हियर वी हैव प्लेस द अल्कोहल सेंसर एंड लिमिट स्विच टू डिटेक्ट द हेलमेट माउंटिंग सो दिस वी कैन सी दिस अल्कोहल सेंसर माउंटेड एंड एट साइड ऑफ दिस वन वी हैव माउंटेड द लिमिट स्विच सो दैट विल दैट वाज यूज्ड टू डिटेक्ट द you can sense the sound so these two sensors are used to detect the one is helmet mounting and other is the alcohol level so when these two are normal then the system will inform to the receiver section so this is the receiver section which we are going to attach to the bike ignition unit so this is relayed to be connected in series with the key ignition so when we are uh, giving key ignition then if it is on then only the system will switch on the uh, bike or car so is a bike one so now uh, we are using electromagnetic relay which is a 5 volts operated and the system communicating to the rf transmitter and receiver so here we are using uh, ht12d for decoder uh, encoder purpose ht12e so the encoder data will be transmitting with the help of this transmitter which is operated at 433 megahertz frequency and at this section also the red color module uh, is called as receiver module and after that the data will be decoded with the help of st12d and that da data will be given to the relay directly without using any programming language and uh, that relay is used to control the ignition so here this is a main on off switch so this will be on when we on the transmitter then only the data will be communicated with this one and this light will be on so it shows the the that uh, the system is getting information from the transmitter it means both are in same uh, nearby only and the next so this is uh, like uh, for uh, to control the ignition and one more feature we have the gsm module and here when we are getting call to the sim card so the microcontroller will auto lift the call and we can speak to the person respective person so there we have mounted one mic sensor so one microphone so here we can see the this alcohol sensor and one is a mic and one more we have placed a speaker also here we can see the speaker directly we can uh, listen to the person and we can uh, we can speak to the person those who call to the sim card so here we have interface the gsm module to the pic 16f73 microcontroller at c6 c7 pin and alcohol sensor at a0 pin and a limit switch to check the mounting status of this helmet which is at to a4 pin and the next rf module interface at the c3 pin so whenever these two conditions are satisfied it will inform to the ignition and when i am getting the call to the sim card which is inserted into the gsm modem so it auto lift the call and we can speak directly to the person so before switch on the kit check the battery connections properly and keep the battery fully charged so to recharge this battery at the ignition end so just connect the b type charger at this slot and keep it till the light color changes so then you can switch off this receiver section one and come into transmitter section so there we can see one more like same b type charger connector connector so just connect the b type charging so this light will blinks initially so once the battery is fully charged automatically it stop blinking and it is continuously on so that's the indication for the battery is fully charged now it's already battery fully charged right okay and the next step is this is the main on off switch you can know to remove this one Just keep it tight and the next insert a valid sim card into the gsm mode so this push to back and open insert a sim card with adapter and insert back so better to use airtel or vi other than jio because jio is not a 4g it's a lte so lte modems is not uh, in market uh, for the project purpose and the next directly right you can switch on the kit so the next step is after switching on the kit so we should hold the microcontroller till it get the signal so you can see the light is blinking fast at a duration of 1 second once the gsm modem get the signal it slows down right because then only we should allow the microcontroller to communicate without getting signal so if the microcontroller start communicating those commands will not be executed as to lift the call or to uh, make the volume increasing so right after the light two times on and off you can now switch on the receiver section now so 
there is loose contact with the transmitter section so you should check clearly right so it should blink like this means it's communicating to that so as of now the relay is after nothing but you didn't mount the helmet on your face so when we mount the limit switch will be presses right you can see that the relay got switched on and off so if the person has alcoholic so then just i'm showing the marker near the alcohol sensor right you can see that the relay got switched off as a alcohol is detected and when it's normal again so we can use the surgical spirit for demonstration also so i'm showing just permanent marker so as it consists of alcohol when i open that it's not working so the next feature is when we call to the sim card call jen right now let us see you will get a some small ringtone So as we can hear the speaker voice from this end, and also we can speak to the person with the help of this mic. Let us see that real time. Right. So let us see that when I am mounting this helmet on my face, then only the ignition will get switched on. See, you can see that. So it's getting switched on. Right. So all the person call me. You can uh, listen to the voice. Hello. Hello. I can hear my voice. Hello, one, two, three, hello. Right. Okay. And next, if the person has all call, then automatically it will be off. Right. Again, okay. it's remote. It will on again. So if I unmount the uh, helmet, then automatically it will be off. So the communication between us will discuss the RF communication. Thank you.